6.33 this morning. If you or a family member have an implanted pacemaker or defibrillator, this next story is really important. Yeah, doctors are concerned magnets in the iPhone 12 could disable the medical devices and pose a potential health risk. So, all new this morning, only on 41 Action News today, Bryant Madrick reveals doctors' concerns and what you can do. This is a defibrillator right here. For people who need it, an implanted defibrillator is a device keeping them alive should their heart stop. But when the iPhone 12 is near someone's implanted device, problems could appear because of magnets in the phone. Cardiologist Sanjay Gupta is with St. Luke's Mid-America. The function of this device um, has a safety feature that can be disabled in the presence of a magnet, and that's been since the very first of these devices. Findings from the Heart Rhythm Society, a nonprofit that focuses on cardiac rhythm disorders, shows magnets in the iPhone 12 are so strong, if a heart stops beating, the phone could stop an implanted defibrillator or pacemaker from providing a life-saving shock to the heart. Apple released a statement which reads, though all iPhone 12 models contain more magnets than prior iPhone models, they're not expected to pose a greater risk of magnetic interference to medical devices than prior iPhone models. Apple's advice, keep the phone at least six inches away from an implanted defibrillator and talk with your doctor. It's not like we would tell them, don't buy an iPhone 12. We would say, you know, you can still use it, just don't put it right over the device, which is what we've been telling them for years. Yeah, and because they've been saying that message for years, it really is hard to kind of break a habit because especially for men, a lot of shirt pockets have the pocket right over the heart, and that's where we put our phones. I know for my coat, that's where I have my phone right now, and here's the zipper and my phone right here on the heart. So if you have one of those implanted devices, you're going to have to really change your habits uh, just to make sure that that life-saving device works if you need it. This morning, we're outside of the Apple store. This is just one place where, of course, you can get that phone, but right. really the message from doctors, just be very careful. Wow. Gus? Yeah, Brian, a lot of men, of course, wearing suit jackets and keep them inside that suit pocket as well, right there over your heart. Are, so the, the question, I think, for a lot of people is, you're talking about iPhone 12s. Are, are magnets in other phones a problem, as problematic? What about other phones for people who don't have an iPhone 12? Yeah, so the doctor I spoke with tells me that they have been warning of people for years who have those implanted pacemakers and defibrillators just to be careful because there are magnets in other phones. But this isn't, while well, it's not a new problem, the new issue here is the fact that this phone has larger magnets that are a lot stronger, and that is the new concern here. It wasn't a concern with some of the older models, but with this new phone, it does bring a new concern. Back to you. Wow, Brian, it's thank so you. easy to not even think about. Sure. Thanks, Brian.